Michael and Josh's mum passed away from cancer last year, when Josh was 11 years old. Easy. She was a nurse. She took care of people. She was basically mum and dad. Before she passed away, she, when she finished chemo and she thought she was all right, she was ready to go back to work. I was like, come on, <laughs> you gotta rest, you know, you gotta rest. All right, come on, Josh, let's get going. I'm coming. Yeah, I definitely miss my mom. I don't know, probably he has like some more questions that he wants to ask me, but he doesn't know how to and stuff. That's what I'm thinking that might be going through his head. Michael told me a little bit about your mum, and she sounds amazing. Sounds like an amazing woman. Mm-hmm. Are you happy to tell me a little bit about her? No? OK. Josh is seeing his sickle cell nurse after being referred by the emergency department, who are worried that his condition is flaring up. The swelling in, a, in an area like his eyes or his lips would, yeah. would usually kind of start wondering if he was allergic to something, like you said. Yeah, that's but what I thought. he's had nothing different that you can think of. No. Josh, have you been thing. biting your lip at all, or did it just suddenly happen? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Sometimes. Sometimes. Have you been sort of putting your teeth on it occasionally? Do you want to if I bite my lip? If when I'm in school and people annoy me, is I'm it? angry. And it starts me from, like, knocking them out. Does it count mm. you control your temper? Yeah. So do you get angry a lot, Joshua? Sometimes. It's difficult having a long-term condition like sickle cell disease. So one of the things that we can do is um, refer you to the psychology department and you can have someone to talk to about that. Yeah. OK. Do you think that would be a good idea? Not today. Not today. What I'll do is I'll refer you on to um, one of the psychologists mm. and if you find that you're getting angry and, mm. you know, obviously he's been through a lot in the last year, it yeah. might be really good for you to have someone to talk to. That'll be good. All right, thank you, you Amanda. See you later. I'll see you later. <laughs> see you later. <laughs> see you later, Joshua. All right. I think there's no easy time to lose somebody that you love. Be good. You may right. think when the child may adapt quickly, or not realise, but children are aware more than we know sometimes of their mortality.